Hey, what's up, everyone? I'm Omar32, and I'll be showing you today uh, how to put a flash or a flash zero theme on your PSP. First of all, the requirements are a custom firmware and someone that, he, that knows what he's doing. Uh, please, if you're not sure that uh, what you're doing is right or um, that you know what you're doing, please don't attempt to do it because it puts a, a risk of breaking your PSP. Um, uh, so, first of all, I've got a Flash Zero theme, A Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep. It was requested by Dark Shadow 556 so I've done it now. Uh, now, uh, open your PSP. And then, plug in your USB connection cable. Then go to USB connection. And click on select. Uh, the VSH or the Vish menu, or I don't know what to call it, will pop up right now. Um, you've got to uh, make the USB device to flash zero. It will be it will be a memory stick. Um, you must click on the right. You must click on the right um, arrow to make it flash zero instead of memory stick. Here you, see, you can see it's memory stick. If you click on the right arrow, it will be flash zero. Then uh, close the VSH or the Vish menu by clicking on select again and open USB connection. Um, this uh, these files will pop up. You must back up all your files, uh, and there are some hidden files and system files. For you to enable them, you must go to Organize, Folder, and Search Options, and the view go to the View tab, and click on Show Hidden Files and Folders, and uncheck High Protected Operating System Files, and then click on Yes, Apply, and OK. These files will, will will appear. Just copy them, copy all of them. Because if you don't back up and uh, you have a semi brick, you can put these files again and uh, go to your to wherever you can ha make your backup. I've got a folder named PSP and make a new folder and call it flash zero flash zero theme oh uh, I wrote it flash <laughs> uh, flash zero backup sorry um, and go into it and paste all, paste all of your files their size is not that big so it won't take uh, space on your computer. After you've copied them, close this window and uh, open your Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep theme yeah, or open your downloaded theme I'll put a link in the description for the Kingdom Hearts theme uh, open this you find the VSH like the VSH in the memory stick uh, it there are in it resource and module you can you must you can copy them uh, to the VSH uh, there will be a font a folder sometimes so if you've got the uh, if you've got the phone folder, uh, just copy it to to the memory stick. Now go um, to the VSH. 
and drag and drop them onto it. Please, I repeat, if you don't, if you got a warning or a not enough space and memory stick like this, uh, just go to the DIC folder and uh, delete uh, the largest uh, file or all of them. It doesn't matter. Just delete the largest because it's about one megabyte, and uh, then try again. Uh, just check and yes and uh, move and replace and do this for the next eight conflicts wait for them to to be copied so just close this window and close this one too You must know the theme is for which firmware because there was the time I downloaded a theme when I was on 3.80 and 33 and the theme was 3.52 and 33 compatible so I downloaded it and put it on my PSP I didn't know it was for it was firmware specific so I downloaded it and put it on my PSP and it bricked my PSP so please do not attempt to put a theme that is not compatible with your firmware if you are got like 3.90 M33 4.01 5.00 M33 don't put less or more if, um, if there's a flash zero theme for uh, 4.01 don't put it on a 5.00 M33 or a 3.90 that's just a warning a fair warning uh, and please uh, subscribe to my channel and subscribe to my videos rate and comment and um, um, subscribe for more HD tutorials and videos thanks for watching